so sorry. I, I didn't mean to offend. I don't need comfort and... Do you usually comfort your flock? That way, Pastor Scott. Hey, that's not fair, Leanne. I was the one that pounced. Why am I not surprised? Well, to be fair, I, I kissed you back. You were probably just being polite, but you, on the other hand... You should, you should go. I'm so sorry. No, there's nothing to apologise for. I went in for the hug. And the trap snapped shut. Anyway, um, I'll keep praying for Damo. A man of the cloth. I know. And you're at work. Yeah, I know. In front of a... D Damo was hanging on by a thread. I'm praying for him too, Leanne, and no one is giving up on him. Except for Desi, by the looks. For goodness sake. Pull yourself together. Damo needs us, and he deserves a lot better than this. So I am scrubbing in with Drew for Mrs. Prasad. Okay. And you're taking over Drew's hernia up? Yeah, I'm just checking the notes now. You okay? Been better. It's not here, it's a TK thing. Okay. Well, best of luck with that. Thanks. Uh, Raj, the anaesthetist has put Misha under, and we should begin shortly. Thank you. Are they underway yet? Uh, they're just about to start. There's extensive soft tissue damage, and she may need a graft. Audra's brilliant at that stuff, so. Yeah, I know. And, uh, if Misha's sedated, she won't be suffering from any more anxiety attacks. Are you okay? Not gonna word. Oh. Sorry, stupid question. Now look, this should never have happened. Yeah, I know, but it's not your fault. Yeah, well, it feels like it. You know, my eyes been off the ball lately. I've been distracted. Look, my wife's gonna need a lot of TLC after this. At least balance that booze with some food. Ugh, nachos. Oi, hey, Koi. You're only guarding me until Cece gets back. Oi, Koi, yeah. Oh, God, look what the cat threw up. What in heaven's name is going on here? Bit of happy hour? Why, you want to wear some nachos? Is that supposed to be funny? Because letting Damo down with another drunken bender certainly isn't. Yes, I let Damo down. Why don't you put it on a billboard? Oh, I know. Check it on the back of a bus. Hey, babe, I'm going to have to call you when you're drinking. You've had enough. <laughs> Fine. They'll take my money down at Dougie's anyway. Yeah, they probably will, sadly. You need to sober up and get back to your husband's bedside. He can sense you're not there. I know it. Shove it up your ass, Leanne. OK, let's call it on the abuse, OK? Get the core queer kiokupu cuz. Why not? I mean, maybe I do, you know? I am a horrible person. You're not horrible. You put a haurangi no iho. You know what makes me a disgusting person? It's because deep down, deep down somewhere, I just, I just want it all to be over. Hey. I just want him to die. <laughs> It's a new day, Desi. You can start over. Start sober, you mean? Exactly. You had your blowout. Now you can take a deep breath and be there for Demo. Yeah, well, I could barely look Donnie in the eyes this morning. Don't worry about Donnie. Rahu's doing all the picking up and the dropping off, and Tilly and Joy will do all the babysitting for him. Right, so you can babysit me. Good morning. Am I seeing an improvement? What's this? Some sort of ambush? No, not at all. We're expecting a very important visitor to lead our prayers for Damo. You've already done your prayers for Damo. Mm, Pastor Scott's all very well. But why send a man to do a woman's job? Oh, this could be her now. Who's she talking about? Rebecca Anderson, Brightshine's leader. Our leading light. Oh, spare me. Here as a special favour to me. Hello, Rebecca. Thank you so much for coming. How could I not? Justine told me how much a friend means to everyone here at Shortland Street. Damo is the heart and soul of the place, isn't he, Leanne? He really is. And this is his wife, Desdemona. So pleased to meet you, Desdemona. Well, everyone calls me Desi. Desi, I know you've been going through a really hard time. Yeah, well, I just want Damo back. 
Do you think you can do some of your faith healing stuff? We believe in the power of prayer. Didn't work last time. Then we try again. The rest is in God's hands, mm. and we trust his mercy. Okay, well, yeah, let's give it a shot. It's not like we've got anything else to lose. Great. Right. Shall we? Yes, let's. Yes.